we went down there because they were having a music festival, a vocal, basically vocal and dance from all different islands that are down there. Everybody comes and brings their own music and, or, or, and performance to this big event, and they all perform. And uh, it, was, it was exciting, and we got to hear a wide range of music and music styles, mostly on the vocal side of it, but also in the dance and the movement. So we all met to see that and take part of that. And then they rented a studio, and we went to, into the studio with some equipment and just played around, you know. Like a like a band, like starting a band, just trying to come up with ideas and getting to know each other. It, the the score is primarily percussive. There's a lot of percussion, and a lot of vocal. You know whether it's the songs, which obviously have vocals, but then also the score has um, a Pacific choir on it. It has a group that Opatia put together, a part of his family, part of his people that he works with, and his group Tavaka. And uh, so this combination of that, that group of singers and the choir and the fact that we're using an orchestra and then we've got racks of percussionists. The, f the uh, ethnic woodwind player that we worked with yesterday, Pedro Eustache, he's playing a bansuri, but made from bamboo from, the Pacific, from one of the Pacific Islands. So it's, you know, we're trying to be very organic about what we're doing here, but we are blending the styles. Much like Lynn and, and myself and Opataya, it's a blend of, of cultures and styles, for sure. I, I love their work, so you know, when, they, when they first pitched this project, that, that really got me excited to work with them, because I've loved what they've done in the past. And yeah, they were, they were very, uh, always pushing for the vocal and the choral element to this score. They really wanted to make sure that that was present, that it was playing a role in the music. Um, and I think the main thing that all of us wanted is we didn't want, we didn't want the music in the score to feel like it could be dropped into another film. We didn't want it like that. We wanted it to be unique to this project. And I think we've achieved that. The music can is like a gigantic magnifying glass. It can enhance it. Um, it can sometimes push you too hard, which you don't want. It can manipulate you, which sometimes you do want, sometimes you don't want it. You have to be very, very careful with it. Um, it can play humor, it can stay away from the humor. But whatever experience you have, it should enhance that experience. And the promise for me, I like to leave the theater and have those tunes in my head when I leave. And if I have them the next day, I'm really happy. And I think this movie has, has those kind of tunes where you, they stick with you and you hear them. Um, I think that's very important. Um, well, How Far I'll Go, which is one of the songs that Moana sings, really represents her. And so I've, I've used, and that was Lynn's song, which is a beautiful song, and I've used that theme in different ways. I've changed it around and used it in, you know, very, very subtle ways. I've used just two notes of it. I've expanded it into a huge orchestral piece. I put it into a minor key and made it feel very emotional that way. So that's, and that's just one of them. So there's several songs. So there's a lot to choose from. Well, for, you know, they have been really great with me. I've worked with them for years. We've done films. We did the musical, the Lion King musical. So I've been with them in the trenches, and, and it's been an incredible journey. But their classic movies, you took away those melodies. Besides the animation, besides all the things that everybody loves, you took home those melodies. And I've always, like every project we've done, Tarzan, Lion King, uh, Moana, I've tried to make sure that you take those themes home with you and, and they stick with you. It's essentially important, I think. Well, first of all, I think the songs are great. You know, we, we, we really tried to avoid having any songs in here that weren't in their own way unique, a different way of doing it, you know, not a formulaic way. Uh, so I think the songs, I think there's a song there for everybody. There's, they're different. They, they're not, there's, there isn't like one style of song. And the backdrop to the movie being percussive and choral and orchestral, but then pop at times and have this really these great rhythms from the South Pacific, all of that stuff is so likable that I just think it's a fun movie. I think people are going to really enjoy that aspect of it.